Well hello there everyone, David your friendly hairy Scotsman here once again. Well, I was out and about today and I was getting a bit peckish and uh, I thought, I fancy a bridey. So I was in a wee place called Burnt Island and I went to one of the best butchers around, I know, at the moment, called Tom Courts. Um, he knows nothing about this video, but I thought I'd get myself a bridey. A steak bridey. So, I've just got it out of the oven. That's a steak bridey. You can tell it's not exactly a small one, it's a lovely size. It smells amazing. So, there we go. One steak bridey. So, let's chop it in half and see what it's like inside. Now this is a proper butcher's bridey, not a baker's bridey. Oh wow. The smell coming out of this is unbelievable, to be honest with you. That is what it's like inside. It is absolutely stuffed full of steak. It's almost like shredded steak. Uh, the other side's pretty much the same. I've just crushed it down slightly there. There's the other side. You can see the steam coming off it there. That is just perfect. So, it seems quite dry. It's not too much gravy in it, which is what I like. It's full of meat. The pastry is really flaky. Really good pastry. So let's see how it tastes. It's hot. Mmm. Mmm. The meat is really juicy, the steak in it. It just melts in your mouth. You hardly have to chew that at all. That is amazing. That is a fantastic bridey. Mmm. There's no grizzle in there. The pastry is crunchy. It's flaky. The meat, it's almost like it's shredded steak. You know, like it's been pulled. That is a fantastic bridey. Now, I usually like a wee bit of ketchup or brown sauce. I've got some ketchup in it today. Uh, pop that up like that. Get a wee squirt. There we go, a wee squirt like that. Let's see what it tastes like with a doddy sauce on it. Mm. <laughs> that is stunning. Now, mm. I usually find with a baker's bridey, there's generally a bit of fill in there as well, a bit of grizzle, a bit of fat. Um, the steak's maybe not quite as good as it could be. It's generally really good, but when you get a proper butcher's bridey, the difference is unbelievable. Um, there's just enough fat in the pastry. You can feel it on your lips there. It's so good. 
the tastes there. The meat is literally just melt in the mouth. It is unbelievable. That is so good, that meat. I'll definitely go and be going back there. And price wise, that's £2.20. You cannot go wrong at that. £2.20 for a, a steak bridey. Um, I stuck it in the oven there for 10 minutes. It's hot enough for me. You can do it in the microwave, but the pastry goes soft and soggy, so it's not quite the same. Um, that is amazing. I am definitely going to be going back there again. Uh, there's no two ways about it. It's probably about maybe 15 minutes from where I live. But it's well worth it. What I might do is actually get a few next time I'm out, put them in the freezer. And when I fancy one the day before, take it out to defrost, bung it in the oven. Yeah. They do sausage rolls, pies. It's a proper butcher as well. I've got some sausages there as well. Um, it is, yeah. That's really, really tasty. Now, I know a lot of you guys in the States or anywhere else, this is probably going to be irrelevant to you because Tom's not out there. But these are good. These are really good. I wish I could send you one. Um, but the way the post office is, it would just be a festering lump by the time it gets there. Um, that is so good. As I say, the meat, it just falls apart in there. It has literally just fallen out. Mm. It's cooked before it's put in as well, so that's just perfect. Mm. Mm. I mean, the meat goes right up to the edge in there. That is almost virtually a perfect uh, bridey. Yeah, definitely. That is fantastic. So, on that note, I'm going to keep this one short and sweet because I'm going to go and enjoy this while it's still hot. And you don't want to watch me try to fiddle bits out my beard. I mean, I suppose I could keep it for later, but no. So, if you enjoy my videos, I would greatly appreciate it. If you haven't already subscribed, if you hit the bell and the button and all that sort of thing, free to do, so you may as well. If you enjoy them, hit the like button. Uh, it really does help the channel quite a lot. And leave a message if you want as well. I'll get uh, So far, I've got back to... Probably most of the folk that leave messages, it might not be within five minutes, but I, tr I definitely try my hardest to reply to every message that's left. So, I'm going to go and enjoy this now. Take care of yourselves, everyone. See ya.